A recent World Net Daily article by Dr. Jerome Corsi amazingly indicates that Obama's Hawaiian long-form birth certificate, which would include a hospital's name and doctor's name, indeed may not exist. Hawaii Democrat Governor Neil Abercrombie told the Honolulu Star Advertiser that he was searching within the Hawaii Department of Health to find definitive vital records that would prove Obama was born in Hawaii because the continuing eligibility controversy could hurt the president's chances of re-election in 2012. Toward the end of that interview, the newspaper asked the governor, You stirred up quite a controversy with your comments regarding birthers and your plan to release more information regarding President Barack Obama's birth certificate. How is that coming? In his response, Abercrombie acknowledged the birth certificate issue will have, quote, political implications for the next presidential election, quote, that we simply cannot have. The governor did not report to the newspaper that he or the Hawaii Department of Health had found Obama's long-form hospital-generated birth certificate. Instead, amazingly, the governor only suggested that his investigations to date might have identified some unspecified notation of Obama's birth that someone had made in the state archives the governor said, quote, It was actually written, I am told, this is what our investigation is showing, it actually exists in the archives written down, end quote. But as we reported here from an earlier World Net Daily article, Tim Adams, a former senior elections official for the city and county of Honolulu in 2008, has maintained all along that there is no long-form hospital-generated birth certificate on file with the Hawaii Department of Health and that neither of Honolulu's two hospitals has any record that Obama was born there. He testifies that he did a personal search in his capacity at the elections office. Could this be why even the Democrat governor cannot seem to find a long-form birth certificate as well? If he does conveniently produce a notation of Obama's birth, how could that be considered a legal indication of an Hawaiian birth? Could you or I even get a driver's license with a notation in some government office that we might have been born in a particular state? As of today, it seems even the newly elected Democrat governor of Hawaii, who wants there to be a birth certificate for the sake of the upcoming election, apparently even he cannot find one either, yet. And so the story continues.